It's the 1.0 release of Shogun Showdown. Ladies and gentlemen, I could not be more excited to play more Shogun Showdown for you. Before we get started and I start rambling about how much I love this game, I have to tell you because I'm legally required to that I'm sponsored for this episode of Shogun Showdown. I was going to play the damn game anyway, but the developers are, are simply far too kind and they refuse to let me make a video without paying me. So I am sponsored to play this. Um, that said... <laughs> I love this game. I've always loved this game. I've been talking about this game for years now. It's an overwhelmingly positive deck building roguelike on Steam. Uh, it's simply fantastic. And the, the 1.0 update added another new character, uh, a bunch of new tiles, new areas, new everything. The game is loaded with content now. Uh, I think it's it's really proper that I do a, an actual mini series on this one. So if you want to see some more Shogun Showdown past this sponsored episode, uh, let me know, like the video, and I'll play more. But let's hop in and, and play some Shogun Showdown. If you haven't seen it before, you'll you'll pick up real fast what's going on. Um, we use these tiles at the bottom to, to do damage to enemies, and that's that, to be honest. It's, it's pretty straightforward. So today, I, I want to challenge myself, okay? Uh, I've played the Wanderer, we've made it to day three, which is kind of an ascension system. Uh, I've played the Ronin, I've made it to day two. Still the ascension system, just a little worse than, than the previous character. I have never won with the Shadow, <laughs> so I probably should play the Shadow, uh, but I have never even played as Jujutsuka, so I think I must play as Jujutsuka today. Uh, I also have not unlocked the the final character in the game that is part of this new update, I believe. Uh, and I gotta defeat the Shogun on day three for that. So I, I think that we're gonna try Jujutsuka today. Um, some funky stuff. So the special ability can throw an enemy standing behind her by moving backwards. I don't know what that means yet, <laughs> but we're gonna find out. And then we have Dragon Punch, which strikes the cell directly ahead and pushes the target as far back as possible and deals collision damage if another target is in the path. Uh, and we have Scar Strike, which then strikes all targets that are not at full HP, which is interesting because we, we would hit them back, more than one person would take damage, and then this would hit everybody that has taken damage. So there's, there's direct synergies with what we got. The cat's saying hello to me. Uh, pretty cool. It's pretty cool. We we also... I'm not sure if this is new to this update or a previous update, uh, but there's now new starting decks for each character, too. So if you obtain three stamps, uh, and then if you defeat the Shogun on day four, you unlock new loadouts. So I actually have three stamps as the Ronin. So you can see here that his typical spear and smoke bomb, we also have the crossbow and the swap toss. Um, so really, they... They kind of added a bunch more characters to the game uh, than what even exists here. It's just a ton of content. It's really good. And we're continuing to unlock more stuff too. Um, I, I just need to get more skulls, which you just get by playing the game. Uh, so we'll continue to get some of that. There's 42 different tiles in the game now. Uh, 36 different skills. You'll see I still have a chunk of them locked. Uh, and there's 36 quests as well, which are... They really don't do anything. They, they're just kind of for fun uh, to mess around with some stuff in the game and, and keep track of your, your achievements and things like that. But let's hop in. I've rambled for long enough. Let's play as Jujutsuka here in, in Shogun Showdown. By the way, you can go to the link in the description and buy the game for yourself. Uh, if you haven't already, what are you doing, to be honest? Uh, let's play Bamboo Grove. Send me in. Okay, so let's, let's, let's do this logically, okay? This is the combo we're going to want to run. So it hits you, you move back, and then that does the, the extra damage. You're going to try to hit me so I get the frick out of the way. And then here's where I want to test throwing. So I'm not facing you. I go back into you. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, that's sick. So the throwing is take them and then launch them as far to the other side as possible. That is going to be pretty cool. So like here, I throw you, you each take damage, and then I combo you. God, that's fun. Um, but this also, I mean, this, this comes with a little bit of 
I'm not gonna say fear, right? But it does come with a bit of, of caution we have to take because this character has no swap, right? I can't change positions with anybody. I, I have to... I, I'm always in kind of one place just doing weird jujitsu. So new tile that I can add, we have a meteor hammer. Strike the first target up to three cells ahead. If successful, it bounces back to hit the cell directly behind the user. Wow, this is interesting. I don't think I've ever used this before. And the shadow comma, strike the cell at distance two ahead. Um, part of me says that this is the best option. Uh, however, I think that this like works well with our build. Right? Because we would be throwing somebody, they would then be going possibly two distance ahead. I think that this is the better better choice for us. Uh, but maybe I'm wrong. You never know. See, this is where, like, typically we would be running to, to gun this guy down. But we can now do, like, weird things like this that are so much better. Right? And then here we, we can hit you from two away. And, uh... Oh, I actually hate this play. <laughs> I hate this play a lot. I need to swap you, send you this way, and then move, move. I need to regen this, and then I need to come this way, come this way, push you to hit him. And then this, it doesn't really matter, to be honest. I can just do this. I, I have to figure out this character here. Because it is definitely... It's different. You're going to hit me. <laughs> like, for sure. Okay, thank you. Very unkind. Oh, I can't do crap here. Okay, I'm taking a ton of damage. Not great, ladies and gentlemen. Not great, but it's fine. You know what? Pop an edamame brew. Just to get uh, a little bit of health back in. We can then kill both of you. Move to here, move to here, jump back, and then I'll just smack you, and then I'll kill you. Okay. Just have to figure out, see like that, my brain collapsed for a second there, because that was very clearly not the correct uh, play to do. Because we, we threw him in a direction where it, it never ended up doing anything, so... It's interesting. It's interesting. It's just very interesting. Um, so Scar Strike feels like this is this is the answer. I I think that this is like the direction that I want this run to go. Imagine if we could find a way to do a little damage to everybody and then just Scar Strike, and that's kind of what this character is is. I feel like that's what they're trying to to have me do, anyway. Okay. That went completely fine. But now we find ourselves in like a weird spot where our we don't have a we don't have a synergy between our two primary damage dealers. I think that's our, our biggest issue right now. Is we we find ourselves in this like weird spot where I have a couple things that synergize together, and then I have some stuff that just doesn't at all. This boss fight was completely fine. <laughs> But in the future, we could have some issues. This, this is now like, I mean, it's, 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 it's interesting. I, I, my brain really wants to go Scar Strike. Um, but the cooldown is just too nasty. Let, let's do this. We need to get ourselves a tile. I do not want to sacrifice a tile. I want to go with a slot upgrade. And you're going to find this insane, what I'm going to do. Um, I'm actually going to slot uh, upgrade Scar Strike because my intention is that we're going to make this insane. I just don't know what I'm making insane with it yet. Enemies inflict plus one damage when attacking each other. That's going to be great. And then I will do two, uh, two damage for five coins. And uh, we could we could go backstabber plus one damage when attacking an enemy from behind, but I'm not really sure I'm attacking enemies from behind unless this counts 
if I'm like not facing them and then this hits them, then that would do even more damage. But I'm 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 not sure it would, because then I would always be behind enemies and this would be too strong. I don't think that that's gonna work. So I'm gonna save my money. Um, we need to take a look at some stuff here. I want this damage upgrade. So let's go to the Hib Hibiku Wastelands here. Just kind of mess around. Get kind of weird, you know? See where things go. Um, so let's... The music's kind of cool. I think I want to just move backwards and then send this guy into him. And then this is now where... If we want to build funky combos, right? We can throw this guy and then well this gets a little scary because this guy is going to immediately activate so i'm going to mass poison kill two of them and then kill the last guy and it's it's not my best i actually misclicked i wanted to to not hit that and then i'll, I'll throw you and then I'll hit you. Dude, I love Scar Strike. Scar Strike is, is very fun. It's very fun. And then you can come here. I'm going to hit you. And then we can Scar Strike. Oh, baby. We got plays, okay? There's no denying. We have some freaking plays. You then hit into a Scar Strike. We, we have the combos that we need to succeed. Ladies and gentlemen, it's good. Back charge, dash backwards, strike the first target behind. Uh, yeah, you know what? I think that this is great. I mean, this is the same thing we already have, and we're not using it that much. So this would allow us on those early ones where we have one of the short little guys that does one damage and I have to, like, race to get over to him. We can use back charge to get to him quicker and then throw him if need be. I kind of like it. I, I kind of like it a lot. That just being a one-shot kill also kind of slaps. So we can move to you. Wait for it. Send you? Oh, brother. It's too good. It's too good. I, I think the thing that I love the most about Shogun Showdown is that it, it like, really... Wow, you still hit me, huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's my bad. Okay. That's my bad. It's, it really masterfully makes you feel excited when when you're hitting the enemies. Because it, it just kind of, I don't know, it's got this very satisfying combat. Where you, you don't often get satisfying combat in, especially a roguelike game. Um, let's... This for the cooldown. I really don't need Scar Strike to be cooldowned. I, I think that we we can mess around with this instead. Um, but you you don't often get satisfying combat in a turn-based game. There, there's only one other game that I have really. Oh, this is a problem. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, you're just gonna hit me. Okay, heal. And then oh, and you're not gonna hit me because you're putting up that. Okay, we're we're fine. We're fine. I don't regret the heal. And then this, I can just smack that into you. You take damage. I'll send you into the barricade. You're going to do a little, little hellfire from the sky. I'm not too concerned. Things are going fine. I can just send you that way. This is a little strange. This is a little strange, but it it's kind of effective. We throw you that way, and then he kills you. <laughs> But you don't get satisfying combat in a turn-based game. And brother, it just has satisfying combat. Fights in tight spaces is the other one. That turn-based game that has like really, really cool, uh, really cool ideas. Sorry, I had to pause my recording because I locked my girlfriend out of our apartment. Um, we wanted to go to the damage upgrade because we're we're going to continue to buff the heck out of Scar Strike. So, give me this. We love that a lot. Um, I would friggin' love to upgrade it again, but I, I don't think that that's gonna happen. Um, can you imagine this being at a, a 4 damage? It's almost overkill. Uh, I say almost, because it's... It would still be fun to do it, but I don't think we need to. Uh, plus 2 max HP, I'm, I'm not that concerned about that either. 
Like, I'd, I'd rather save our money to get some insane upgrades on some of our stuff. Uh, cause we've got Moonlit Port and then the, you got like another area and then it's the final boss. So we have quite a few upgrades that we can still get. Uh, and that makes me not that concerned about this, to be honest with you. So send them and kill them. This guy is a little annoying. <laughs> And I'm not, I'm like pretty far away, so I need to tackle him first and get him out of here. I'd like to back up into this guy. Ideally, you're going to summon some enemies. What the frick? This is horrible. <laughs> uh, this is, this is terrible, to be honest. I need to hit you, kill you, and then send you. That could have been a lot worse. I mean, I feel like we kind of we kind of lucked out a little there, but it it works out. Um, let's this was incorrect. <laughs> this was incorrect. So I need to go to here and then. Yeah, I mean, you just hit me. There's there's no getting around that. And there's no reason to use my cooldown. So just back up into this guy. Then we'll send him over. Get out of the way. And then... I have to just kill him. I'm gonna get hit again. Okay, I'm, I'm playing stupid. <laughs> I'm playing stupid. Stop playing stupid, Tyler. We're, we're trying to get too fancy is, is a big part of the problem. Um, this is a problem too, though. I need to collect this and then shield. God, man. Uh, when, you, when you lose uh, mobility, this game gets a lot harder. Like, we're, we're finding this character. This character is great in the early game <laughs> and then it gets a little scary okay it gets a little scary so free play plus three cooldown um i exceed max cooldown if i do this i don't i don't think we want free play this is where we want to upgrade okay so minus one damage minus four cooldown uh gets interesting to be honest with you i love this I love this as an idea. A zero damage attack that I can use every time. Because here's where it gets interesting, right? That still hits him. So we we can get kind of weird with this, right? Where I, I can hit somebody for zero and then just keep punching them back over and over. And you're looking at this and you're going, Tyler, what the hell is the point? Uh, the point is that I'm able to get small amounts of damage on them. Uh, I'd like to remove this, punch you back, send you, and then pop this, kill ya, beautiful. And then this is where we can just do like this. We're, we're underusing this ability. It's really good. Okay, I mean, like, it's 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 a very, very good ability, and I should be using it a lot more than what I am. Um, just push him back. I'm, I'm not going to sweat this too much. Okay, beautiful. So I'm going to push him into him that's going to kill him. I'm going to push back into him It's going to hit him. And I'm going to push you back. Uh, I'm going to send you into him. Beautiful, you're all dead. Uh... We have another wave. Let's just wait. I I love I love the fact that this character we can play the game to where we don't do anything. <laughs> like we don't move. It's a character that doesn't require moving. Is stuff never spawning ever again? Am I am I in a scenario where uh, they just wouldn't bring in the new wave until I, I killed him? Okay, that's fine. We can launch you. Uh, I gotta be careful about this. Send you into him. Okay. That's gonna push you all the way back. Let's, let's wait on that. I can just kill you with this. Okay. If we take our time, this gets, this gets a little easier. Sacrifice the tile for 40 coins. We do not need to do that. 
Just do this. Plus one upgrade slot, minus one cooldown. I mean, come on, right? That that seems way too good to pass up. I, I can't in my right mind put another <laughs> another upgrade onto this guy. I mean that's just that's just a little absurd. So I think this is fine. Um this is going to be a massive cooldown. Or a massive combo. But the problem is this guy's gonna hit me if I follow through with this. So I have to. I gotta do this differently. I gotta do this. He now hits him. I would hit you, move all the way back, hit you. That does not help me. But if I do this, that still does not help me. <laughs> okay. Um, I have to kill this guy first. Okay. Move this out of here. Send him into him. And then we can do like this right yeah still like not as great as what i wanted it to be but it got the job done you i push you all the way back into him that does not help but this will i can take that off it's it's just a layer of complexity that my my puny little brain cannot quite figure out Okay, I need to push you into him. You're going to try to hit me. But then this is the huge play, because guess what? We combo, baby. That was like the closest we've gotten to the, the wombo working the way I want it to. Uh, you're gonna try to hit me? I'm not concerned, I push you back. This, this is the thing, man, is this, this stupid, uh, the, the stupid zero damage dragon punch is so good. <laughs> is actually just so good. Okay. Toss him. Lovely. That's so good. That's so good. Then we do this and this. And we are we are in the clear, brother. We are in the clear. Come here and I'll smack you. That's a flawless section, uh, and I feel very good about it. Plus one damage, don't mind if I do. I don't know, we're insta-killing everything. <laughs> but don't mind if I do. It's going to be useful uh, in this fight. It's going to be useful in this fight. This is actually just like the ideal fight for this. So, we're gonna do this. Hit you, go back, hit them both, and then throw them. So go ahead, send them that way, and you're going to have a great time. Then I hit you. Uh, yeah, poor play by me, but now you're inside of them. I hit you both for a lot. You're gonna try to come towards me. I cannot stop that. <laughs> I cannot stop that. There's one damage. Um, you're gonna go through me. And then I'm going to tell you, I'm going to pause and I'm just going to throw you at him. And then, I don't know, just dragon punch him into him, kill them both. It, it worked out fine. It worked out fine. I still feel good about where we're at. Um, Tetsubo, strike the cell directly ahead. Four damage, but a massive cooldown. It's an insane cooldown. I think I just want a swirl. Swirl is a simple, you know, hit, hit two sides. I think that that works fine. I could sacrifice it. Okay, yeah, you know what? <laughs> let's let's go kind of stupid here. I could also do the shop upgrade. It's kinda. I would so much rather unlock new content, man. Sure, I'll buy this. We have a ton of money at this point. Sure, I'll 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 upgrade it. Get it. Get another one going. Plus one damage to attacks if you moved with a tile in the same turn. Yeah, that's that's like stupid good. <laughs> really stupid good. Um, I don't think I've ever been to the Forsaken Ground, so let's let's send it and see what's crack a lacking in the in the Forsaken Grounds here. Okay. Um, what do you do, my guy? Upon death, explodes, dealing two damage to any unit in adjacent cells. Okay, so I want to throw you. I mean, that's so disgusting. That's so disgusting. 
Uh, this is so disgusting. This this character was made for this area. <laughs> I mean, we we just we just body you. We just body you. Okay. Um, send him into him. <laughs> It's so good, man. It's so good. Why is it so good? Ah, uh, yeah, that one was my bad, though. That was my bad. Uh, okay. I don't even know what I want to do here. Like, I, I feel like I should be... I feel like I should be doing something way different than what I'm doing. I'm, I'm playing like a dummy. I'm playing like a dummy. Heal me. Punch him back into him. I take two damage, but at least he kills him. I don't know why I decided to throw that guy. I did not need to throw that guy. Okay. Not perfect. Okay, not perfect. Plus one damage, plus one cooldown. Um, sure, yeah, I'll, I'll mess with that. Get our katana, or kama. Uh, katana, kama, same damn thing in my eyes. Okay, who are you? Dash when moving advance as far as possible in the chosen direction. That's gross. I do not like that. I'm gonna send you that way. You're gonna hit him. And then I'll kill you. I'm not not afraid to to just do a little little wiping of you. Let's let's hit him a little again. Let let's see if I can get I mean we we can do a insane combo here right like i if i do this and then this i kill five people in one turn <laughs> okay yeah quest complete supreme combo that's actually nuts uh quest complete deal 25 damage in a single attack <laughs> okay pretty fun um I'd say that's pretty fun. I'm gonna mass poison and then hit you so that that guy dies. You're gonna come all the way towards me. Um, that's fine. I'm just gonna send you all the way back, my guy. And then you're, like, still a little poisoned. I'll just kill you. Okay. This is fine. Uh, this is not fine. I'm taking a ton of damage. I'm an idiot. Okay. Yeah, this, this, that sounds about right. Okay, let's just kill you both. You're gonna come towards me. Uh, I'm just gonna throw you that way, and then I'm gonna combo you. That seems, that seems extremely plausible. Okay, minus one cooldown. Uh, at this point, I'm gonna not do it, and I'm gonna upgrade this instead. Minus one cooldown. I probably should have rerolled that. I got 66 money, man. What about do it with it? I should have rerolled that. Okay. Come back, send them. God, what a play. What a freaking play. It just feels good. It just feels great. Send ya. Send ya. I'm so ready. Uh, yeah, you know what? Kill them. Send this guy. <laughs> just patiently wait for him to spawn and then murder him. Okay, hello. Not too worried about you. You you exist. And that's about all. You do you do not pose a threat to me. Okay. Um plus one damage, plus one cooldown. I don't need. We need to get something great here. Shockwave. <laughs> so any touching enemies, it would then spread. I don't think that's good enough, man. Plus one damage. Okay, dragon punch, get upgraded. I think that that's still fine. Fumiko the Fallen, hello. I awoke and the moon bears a scar. Okay, what are, what is your, what's your vibe? I don't know what your vibe is. And thus you kind of scare me. Can I throw you into these guys? I sure can. Can I throw you into that guy? I sure can. You're gonna curse me? Really? That seems kind of rude, don't you think? Okay, turn around, send you that way. Hit ya. Just a disgusting play, to be honest. Uh, and then, sure. Send ya. And then, uh, I'm gonna tell you. 
You are long for this world. Goodbye. <laughs> okay. Um, easy boss fight. It's time to spend some money. Okay, we need some money. It's another scar strike. We don't need it. We we need this shuriken in order to deal a quick damage to somebody. That's the best play. Give me the warrior's gamble. I don't 100% know what this is. Randomize the tile into a new one and all upgrades will be randomized. I kind of hate that. Special move throw inflicts a damage. Minus one cooldown for it. Okay. Um, sure. I'm going to sell one of these. I'm going to buy one of these. We're now max health. I'm going to take some more money. Do I really want to warrior's gamble? Yeah, of course I do. Let's randomize that. Grappling hook to pull the first target forward. I'm going to tell you that's actively horrible. Charging forward, I can I can mess around with. Okay. We got we got we got plenty of place still to roll right now, man. A lot of place to roll. Okay. Um you seem wacky. Trickster dancing in the shadows of your own moves. Okay. I don't love whatever that's about, so let's just not do it. Then we'll we'll patiently wait. Hitcha? Send ya? Kill ya? Shouldn't have done that, for sure. Should not have done that. Shield me. Let him hit. Uh, am I dumb? Yeah, I might be dumb. I might I might be I might be stupid. <laughs> Just let him hit me, okay? I'm gonna punch him into him and kill him. That's one of those just just cut your losses at that point. Now, this is a fun combo. So you do this, you do this, you do this. And then that lines us up where on, on other maps, man, we could end up with some insane Wombus Combus from this. So it's back, forward, smack. That's not quite good enough. So let's go forward, back, smack. Let's go forward, smack, back. Forward smack back. Yeah. And then throw. <laughs> Little wacky, but you know what? It 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 does something. Whether it's good or bad, I don't know. But it does something. Plus one damage, plus one cooldown. I don't think so. Let's go minus one cooldown. I'm gonna put that on you. Probably could start to put cooldown on my, my scar strike if I wanted to be intelligent, but I'm having so much more fun being an idiot. You stole my, my Kamehameha. Okay. You're not going to use it, though, because I'm standing right next to you, dummy. Stupid, stupid dummy idiot. Dummy. Okay, you're going to you're gonna do my, my super strike, huh? Okay. How about you go super strike over there and kill both of them? Dumbass. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, hit you. Boom. Boom. Back up smack and then smack i do not like uh this person they they give me vibes that i'm not with they they make me unhappy but i'm handling them fine so i guess i i actually love them plus one damage it's really hard to not do this right i mean two damage on the dragon punch we we continue to build some some pretty sick plays so, back up, go forward, I'm going to throw you first though, uh, yeah, it ain't perfect, okay, it ain't perfect, but I think it's fine, throw him, kill him, dragon punch will kill this guy, okay. Back up, go forward, and then yeah, I'm, I'm good with this. So back up, go forward, kill two, good combo. I'll kill you before you kill me, that sounds good too. Okay, um, this is a nice combo. <laughs> There's something so ridiculously satisfying about throwing, throwing the bomb guy into enemies is, is just... It just feels nice, man. It just feels nice. Okay, go into you. I'll get out of your way. That sounds nice. I'll throw you that way. You summoning more people yet? I'll wait like a couple turns for you to maybe summon. You ain't summoning. I'm just gonna kill you. Okay. 
Let's super punch you. That's going to send you into him. I'll hit you. You're now doing a dragon punch. I'm just going to back up. Okay. Um, then we'll do this. And then this. So we're going to kill these two. Run into him. Kill him. And then that lines me up for, like, a uh, turn around, throw him, and it does the damage to him. That went fine. Minus one cooldown, sure. I'll, uh, you know what? No, I'll bite. <laughs> Will I ever use these two, uh, these two upgrade slots? Yes, at some point I will. But that time is not now. So you're planning on, on doing a little mimicry, huh? little mimicry? Oh, I hate that. That is not what I want you to do to me. So that's going to be like a little annoying. But you're going to back up. I'm going to hit ya. Yeah, I'm just going to hit ya. That sounds fine. Uh, what the frick is this? <laughs> Drop the curtain and go to the next act. Excuse me? I don't know what that means. Act 2, Mirror Clash? <laughs> okay. You know what? I respect it heavily. I really do. Alright. I back up, I go forward, I hit both of you. And then I throw you... Nah, I'm just gonna move forward. Okay. Then we can do one of these. Kill you both. I'm gonna back up. You don't really know what to do with me. Uh, you don't really know what to do with me. Hey, guess what? You're uh, Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> Dragon punch? I don't think so. You can stop hitting yourself. <laughs> okay. Very good. Very good. Give me this. This is going to give you like a little smack. Okay. Dragon punch? No, I don't think so, to be honest. I'm, I'm going to pass on you uh, dragon punching me. So we're going to go forward, hit you, and then go back. I think that this is... Uh, very acceptable. You're going to go to the next act. I'm going to queue up a dragon punch. I do not like this, for the record. Dragon punch will kill two of them. Just puts me in a tough spot, to be honest with you. I mean, you, you just run and hit me. And then you also come run and hit me. It's extremely rude of you. I could I could have planned that ahead better, um, but alas, I'm kind of terrible at the game, so I guess that that uh, is less less good. Okay, boom, 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 hits you, hits you, dragon punches you, which kills him, which kills all of you, and did like a crap load of damage to you. Yeah, I took some damage there. That's extremely fair. Not my finest showing, okay, uh, but a boss I've never fought before, so I didn't know what to expect. I blame it on that. Plus one damage, plus one cooldown, uh, I'll pass. Sacrifice the tile, I'll pass. I'm doing a lot here that I should not be doing. Give me an upgrade slot to this guy. We're, we're gunning for a... I don't need sacrifice tile, give me, give me the, the damage upgrade. Okay, 15 enemies drop an extra coin when combo killed. Um, I mean, I'm in a blood service because I'm a little freak. When performing a combo kill, random enemy is frozen. We combo kill all the time, man. Th this is the correct play, and I will hear no others. And I will not unlock the shop. I'm saving my money to unlock new tiles. This place is gorgeous. I've never been here before either. New content. We love new content. Okay, I can kill both of you. Um, so just do it. You little freak show, just do it. Okay, I throw you, and then I kill you. This is where the combos, man, they are they are so nice. They're so freaking nice. Okay, do not try to come hither, okay? Do not come hither. I, I do not want your hithering right now. <laughs> oh, you poor soul. <laughs> okay, um, dash forward, shadow punch you smack you it's another combo and then i'll kill you dude we we've got we've kind of got that like 
completely busted build now i i think that we we are accomplishing great things you're gonna try to come forward i don't think so i'm just gonna come back but i need to find a way to combat this which is just a shadow punch i mean he's gonna come forward again uh, i'm very stuck yeah, the Shadow Punch just kills me. I was kind of afraid of that. <laughs> like, I kind of thought it was going to happen, but I was I was choosing to just uh, ignore it at that time. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Back up. And then just kill him. Are you going to Kami me? Absolutely not. I'll just kill you. A lot of waves on this one. Um, but this will just take care of business. The freeze just makes it that much easier man so simple i mean just simplistic and then a shadow punch to send you to the shadow realm let's actually let's use some of this stuff because i i have a heal potion on the ground that i would prefer to have okay i would like to have it send you kill you you're frozen on the back rank um I'm just gonna, like, walk over and do that. I don't want to get too close to you. You kind of scare me. Okay, curse plus two cooldown. Cursed enemies take double damage on the next hit. I think you gotta do this, okay? I understand we've been enjoying that being free, but adding curse to people sounds insane. Iyasu the patient. Why do you fight Jujutsuka? Why do you fight, little freak? Okay. Can I send you into him? What are you doing? Swap positions with the boss. Okay. Okay, I see what vibes you're going for. So now you're here, and you are dashing and then hitting me. We got problems, okay? We got problems. We're gonna we're gonna start with a little bit of this action, and I think that his his funky little thing that he has, this guy, I don't think he can die. If if I'm imagining things correctly, I have a feeling that his ass can't die. So, so let's do this accordingly. Like hitting him, eh, it does nothing. Okay, that's fine. So, back up. Send them. That kills them. You're going to swap positions with the boss. The problem is that I don't have a way out of that, man. Like... He's just going to spawn. I don't have any way to get rid of him. This makes it very difficult. You're hitting me for five. I I can't I can't compete. Can't compete. I gotta I gotta figure out a better solution here because we're we're gonna have some problems. Okay. Um He's gonna swap. Let's do something like this. Uh, am I dead? I need to... I need to kill him, but I, I can't. <laughs> I mean, he's just gonna get me. I don't know how you compete against this guy. Like, this, this five damage is not enough to kill him, man. Wow. <laughs> I, I wasn't 100% sure how to handle that fight. Because he, he would always have the space to get in and then kill me. Okay, okay, you know what, new boss, you, you have, you've kind of conquered me on that one. I'm gonna unlock this tile. A little, a little dagger, that's fine. Just brutal, it's a brutal, brutal loss. I feel, I feel upset. And I feel uh, like I want revenge. So perhaps next episode, I'll play as Jujutsuka again. Or we're going to play uh, level day three as the Wanderer and just try to get try to get this, this new character unlocked and then mess around with them. Uh, but Shogun Shodan, what can I say? It's just, it's just an amazing game. Uh, if you haven't checked this one out for yourself, link in the description. You can go pick it up right now. Uh, thanks again to the devs for sponsoring this episode of Shogun Shodan. Very sweet of them again for doing so. Uh, that's all I got. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.